Hey guys, Mal here from FishingTownsville.net. Today I'd like to take a look at a couple of new products just out from Shimano. What we have here is the new Stellar 4000 SWV on a T-Curve uh, Generation 3 T-Curve TK3701 spin. Now, I haven't used this outfit yet, so I'm not sure how it's going to perform. So don't consider this a product review. This is just a, a first look and a chance to see the, uh, the reel and give you my opinion on how it feels straight up. First of all, I guess it looks absolutely fantastic. The, uh, the black reel on a, a dark rod with the EVA grip is, uh, is very, very, very good looking. It's a little bit heavy. The Stellar 4000 uh, in the SWB is around about 100 grams heavier than the uh, 4000 FE. So it's a slightly heavy outfit. Uh, but it still feels really well balanced and uh, really good in the hand. The SW series of Stellars, I guess, are designed a little bit more for a heavy duty application than the FE. And so that extra 100 grams goes into making a reel that's a little bit stronger, a little bit more robust uh, for offshore bigger blue water fish. Now, I've got this loaded with the 20 pound Power Pro. And you know, my intentions are to use this to target things like finger mark uh, with big gimp lures, uh, but even using it to chase in barramundi on thready busters and things in the deeper holes. Um, but you know, like it's a really, really, really sturdy outfit, and I anticipate that this would be just fine even chasing things like little blacks and sailfish down in Bowling Green Bay. The handle on this reel is very, very different from Shimano. It's uh, a Aluminium handle, uh, beautifully balanced with a couple of uh, stainless steel bearings in there. But something that's quite new from Shimano, not something they've done before. The gold against black on this new Ranger Stellar SWBs is simply stunning. It is a beautiful, beautiful looking reel. The TK3 series of rods, as I said, is the third generation T-curves. Uh, and this one is a, a lovely rod. It's the 701 Snapper Spin replaces the old 701 um, that's been around for a little while. Uh, split EVA butt. I'm a big fan of cork, so you know getting used to EVA uh, again is, is a little bit different for me, but it's a, it's a good quality, uh, nice firm EVA and it feels good in the hand. So you know, I don't think that'll take too long to get used to. The, uh, the guides on this are Shimano's Tangle Free Guides, so they look a little bit different. Uh, but yeah, they're supposed to keep the uh, the tangle out of the braid. This rod is a one piece, seven foot, five to ten kilo uh, blank, which is perfectly suited to the four thousand size reels, uh, and will fish the twenty pound Power Pro no worries. Uh, the lure rating is around about ten to forty grams, so again, perfectly suited to small slugs, gimp lures, thready busters, etc. Uh, it's got a nice feel to it, a nice snappy tip, uh, beautiful curve to it when you bend it and uh, it is more than more than capable of some serious fish. Okay guys, so there you have it. Um, as I said, I didn't want to do a full product review of this, uh, this particular combo just yet as it hasn't been used. Uh, it was just a chance to have a first look at the, uh, the reel and a little bit of a talk about how I intend to use it and my first thoughts on how it feels in the hand. Uh, so look out in the next few weeks as the, the reel gets a, a workout off shore and uh, I'll definitely do a full product review in the next uh, few months. As I said, the uh, Stella 4000 has a ridiculous set of features, uh, but just to sum it up, we're looking at a capacity of around about 265 meters of 15 pound power pro, a gear ratio of 6.2 to one, that retrieves 95 centimeters of line per turn of the handle, no less than 14 plus one stainless steel bearings, 11 kilograms of drag, which is a phenomenal amount of drag in a 4,000 size reel, uh, but it does come in at about 380 grams, which as I said, is around about 100 grams heavier than the 4,000 FE. This particular rod from the TK3G series is, as I said, Shimano's third generation of T-curve rods. This one's model is the TK3G701 spin, it is 2.13 meters in length, which is approximately seven feet. It is a single piece rod, five to 10 kilo line capacity, and 10 to 40 grams uh, for the lure weight. 
split EVA grips and Fuji K Alkanite guides uh, finishes this rod. Don't forget that you can uh, follow all of my writing at fishingdownsville.com or you can join us on Facebook at facebook.com forward slash fishingtownsville and you can also follow us on Twitter at twitter.com forward slash fishtownsville.